Maya is strong and resilient. You would not know meeting her that she is the survivor of unthinkable violence perpetrated on the most innocent. An emotional reunion for young Maya Zamora and her family with the people who saved her life, organized by the South Texas Blood and Tissue Center. We, she didn't have the blood that she had available to her. She wouldn't be here today. Maya spent 66 days in the hospital following the mass shooting at Robb Elementary, fighting for her life after being shot multiple times in her arms, hands, back and chest. Air medics worked tirelessly to stabilize her on the flight from Uvalde to San Antonio. Maya, you made this work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was a busy, busy 30 minutes. It's so incredible to see you. Well, how else would you make money? Gotta work. Dr. Ronald Stewart was one of Maya's doctors at University Hospital. He's a trauma specialist and an advocate for whole blood transfusions, like Maya got while inside of the helicopter. It's literally what profession we live to do. It's, it's worth more than I can describe. Yeah. Maya, Maya. Now that Maya has a second chance at life, she can chase all of her dreams, whether that's painting, dancing, or animals. Always live your dream because you never know when life is going to end. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.